A group of dangerously cute, look at these guys, animals. They break out of their enclosures and they head, oh, crikey, back to the outback. Okay, uh, this great movie uh, is on Netflix. It starts tomorrow. I got to see this over the weekend with my kids and I loved it. We have Kimberly here. Oh wait, we have a song. Let, let's watch part of the movie first because I'm nervous with the snake. Welcome to the Australian Wildlife Park. Whoa! Home to the cutest animals in the world. Oh my gosh, it's Pretty Boy! <laughs> this is Mission Control patching you through to Pretty Boy now. Oh. And the Outback's most dangerous animals. These animals are deadly. <laughs> He's a horrible he's Ugh. Ugh, gross. <laughs> they made them look so cute. Uh, Kimberly Wright from Wild Wonders is here with some of the few friends that you're going to see in the movie. And look at this baby. Everybody here is like freaking out, Kimberly, when I'm holding this guy. <laughs> but this is like a boa. He's not going to do anything. He is. He's right? very mellow. Yeah, they get a bad reputation, yeah. just like in the movie. Just because of the way they move, the way they look. And they look kind of scary and creepy, yeah. but they're really not. They have an important job to do in the wild. Okay, we're going to kind of go through um, all these animals and right. kind of, you know, do what the movie is trying to explain, which yeah. is don't be, don't be scared of it. They're just being themselves, right? Like, Absolutely. this guy couldn't be more adorable. Like, I'm petting him and he loves it. I know, I know. I know. Yeah, well, snakes are creepy. They're not. First up, uh, we have this guy down here, the bearded dragon. Yes. Uh, this guy's awesome. You said I could pick him up, but now I got this dude on my hand. I yeah. can't pick up the bearded dragon. Yeah, I know. It takes two hands. But yeah, yeah this is um, bearded dragon, and they're pretty impressive. They're um, from the outback of Australia, and they're one of the predominant um, characters, one of the thorny thorny lizards in um, <clears throat> in uh, Back to the Outback. Right. And he gets a black beard sometimes when they want to be territorial or sure. when they're trying to find a girlfriend or oh. a boyfriend out there. Really? Yeah. So they have a lot of cool characteristics. So they maybe look a little bit creepy and scary, yeah. but they're really not. They're just being mellow and, and relaxed. Okay, and how long do these guys live? Watch me pet, because I have the one hand. I, Go I, ahead. Look oh, there, at, now oh, you see him puff up. What does that up. mean? So he's puffing up because it's either he likes it or maybe he's a little bit nervous. He's like, you're not sure about you yet. <laughs> Okay, but buddy. he's being pretty mellow. That's yeah, good. Yeah, right? Oh my God. How? Oh, and it's just like spiny with the. Describe what I'm feeling here. I can't. I don't even so know. It's it just... kind of feels like sandpaper almost, yeah. right? Kind of really sharp spines. And um, that guy is. That's just part of his protection. It kind of like a mimic sure. to frighten, to just kind of show people and frighten them away. But it's right. not really. He's not really um, okay. a bad guy right. dude at all. He's, he's a really being sweet. a really good boy right now. Yeah. Right. Good okay. Who, who do you want to like have the tarantula? I know we yes. have the cane toad. He's last. Yeah, he's last. So I okay. have his tarantula Whoa. here. Yeah. So they have tarantulas all over the globe, and especially in the outback, and they have venom. Sure. And they've got big fangs, right? And they look big and scary, but really all they want to eat are crickets in, in really? small yeah. things. Yeah, maybe a mice or two, something small like that. But they really don't want to harm a human at right. all. They're small, but they kind of just look kind of creepy, but that means they can just get a bad rap. Yeah. So we need to really um, appreciate these animals for the job that they do and that they're individuals. Right. right? My wife is deathly afraid of spiders, and I tell her, we had a tarantula in our back, and I said, it, it's not going to hurt you. No. And in fact, it helps, right? It does. Yeah. It helps, because they eat the bugs that bug us. Yeah. Right? Would Super he crawl important. on my sleeve for like a few seconds? So this is cool. Probably not have, with him on there. Oh, what if I go like <laughs> this? Would that be separate mm, enough? Probably not. Let's not mess around. If Kimberly <laughs> says, yeah, I mean, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not scared of the spiders or the tarantulas. No. Okay, who do you want to bring out okay, next? Okay, so Kimberly? I do have, I do have a big bufo I'm toad friends to show you. What's the snake's name again? The snake name is Ozzy. Ozzy. So that's a pretty good name. That's a good name, Ozzy. You're okay, a good so snake. Okay, so one Whoa. of the. Okay, oh. this is guy is kind of little. <laughs> Okay, so I love this how I'm is, holding a snake, oh, but go. it's the frog that freaks me out. Here we go. We'll get a close-up on him because I got to hold him a little bit tired because he's a big boy. He's going to be a lot bigger. This is a bufo toad. So this is like the frogs that were in um, Back to the Outback. Back to the Outback, uh, Which yeah. actually premieres tomorrow, tomorrow. December 10th, right? Yes. So you got to watch it because it's an amazing, amazing movie. So here we go. And this little guy, it looks kind of big and scary and kind of yeah. creepy, right? But he's really a pretty mellow dude. He's just going to get a lot bigger. Okay. He's going to get about, bigger? Out, big, about the big as a salad plate. Oh my God! Oh, whoa, whoa. Whoa. <laughs> nice catch! Oh. You guys, <laughs> fast reflexes in this game, right? <laughs> now wait a minute. I noticed there is some um, activity uh, of, of the bathroom kind. Uh, oh Is he yeah. scared and kind of like? He's probably telling me, okay, I'm ready to be put down. I'm ready to be on my own. Thank sure, you. Sure, <laughs> sure. Okay, so let's put him back in there because he needs to chill out a little bit. 
Uh, I know, buddy. I'm sorry, but okay. Uh, who, who's next? And then we have this little lovely guy, this okay. Ozzy, our, our python there. And so you see he's pretty mellow dude, and he's just a constrictor, so yeah. he doesn't have fangs or anything, but they do get a bad reputation just because of the way they move. So we really have to appreciate ooh, ooh, animals like, for what they are. I got a little tongue. Oh. So he's smelling. He's, he's tasting smelling. the air. Yeah, is that good, Bubba? It's good because they have this little organ on the roof of their mouth and it tells them what all those smells are. So sure. today it's telling them that you're not a mouse for him to eat. You, yes. Well, I'm glad he could tell. Uh, my question is always like, you know, uh, this guy wouldn't hurt you, but if you see him out in the wild or something, it's scary because you don't know which one's poisonous or which one could hurt you and yes. you know that's my thing I don't I can't tell and so what we say is we just kind of admire them from a distance because you really can't tell good the advice. difference yep, right good so we don't want to make it very good okay do we have one final hello baby did we bring out the, the blue tongue yeah okay. I have the blue this, tongue this is this is the cool dude the not that they're all not cool but blue tongue skin is that look at this dude is awesome and what they call them in Australia is Sheila and that's her name because that's a girl oh, no, Sheila. and I see in the outback so she is a very famous blue tongue skink right. from the outback of Australia and we'll put Erwin wow. away just because he wants to be on his own now do these two guys get along um, do any probably of these guys in the wild they kind of avoid each other a little yeah. bit and they kind of respect each other's territory, I guess. Right. Okay. I'm sure they do. And she has the, a blue tongue. She sticks it out. Now let's see if we can see the blue tongue. Because over that here. means danger. That means stay away here, and poison. Come look at his blue tongue, Jose. Don't be scared. Now she's not poisonous at all, but oh, the blue the tongue thing. actually is a warning to other predators oh, that really? maybe think that she might be dangerous or poisonous. Wow. So I mean, it's just for protection, really. It's a beautiful so, creature, isn't it? You just have to understand that animals come in all shapes, all sizes. Yeah. Creepy may be looking to us as humans, but not to each other. That's a cool thing. You know, in, in the movie, it's kind of the point. Just because they may look, quote, unquote, ugly to you, yeah. they're the, like unique creatures in and of, uh, you know, and leave them alone. <laughs> well, they absolutely are. <laughs> they're like are. our little friends. Well, it's like you and I look different right. to each other, right? So they look a little bit different, but it doesn't mean that they're bad guys at all. They're maybe not the furriest and, and fuzziest that we think, but I yeah. think they're just, they're worth our love yeah, and protection, guy, just the same. That guy's super cool. Um, does, does Ozzy hang out with people this calmly like everybody, or does he like me? I think he really likes you. That's good answer, Kimberly, good answer. <laughs> uh, by the way, uh, we, we brought these guys on because Back to the Outback uh, premieres on Netflix starting tomorrow, Friday the 10th. Is it the 10th already of December? It I is. should get some Christmas uh, shopping done. And the movie's adorable. I mean, the way that they animated it with the big eyes, and they, they made them look cute, right? They do. They're really, it's a really amazing movie. I loved yeah. it. And I think the message is really important. Right. I love this. Kimberly, thank you for bringing our friends. Um, all the information is on fox5sandiego.com if you want to go visit Wild Wonders or have them come to you. And you got to check out Back to the Outback on Netflix tomorrow. Okay, you want to say it? We'll be right back. No, no, no. Sorry, baby. No, no, no. Don't, don't, don't be weirded out. We'll be right back. Hello.